Hi, Children's Chapel. Today we are talking about sheeps. This is a Pokemon sheep, but we're talking about sheep. Did you know that once there was a sheep? His name was Shrek. I'm not making this up. His name was Shrek. He was a sheep named Shrek, and he lived with people, and the people took care of him. And once a year, they sheared, they took all the wool off of his body so that he could have a nice, fresh haircut, kind of like me. But one day, Shrek escaped. He ran away, and he ran off into the wilderness, where he hung out for six years. And you know what happened while he was there? He didn't have anyone to take care of him, and he didn't have anyone to cut his hair. So it grew, and it grew, and it grew, until he had 60 pounds of wool. That's a lot. 60 pounds of wool that he was carrying around. It fell over his eyes, and he couldn't see very well. It was so thick and heavy, he couldn't walk very well. It got dirty, it had bugs in it. It was not a good situation. So Shrek came home. He found his people again, the ones who had taken care of him before, and they said, Shrek, you have so much wool. It's so heavy. You can't see. You're not clean. And he said, I know. I am not a comfortable sheep. So they sheared him all 60 pounds of wool, and then he was fresh, clean, happy, able to run and jump and see and keep himself clean. Now you might be thinking, wait a minute. Sheep are animals. They're supposed to live in nature. They shouldn't need help from people to live healthy, safe lives. But that's the thing about sheep. They're not wild animals. They're not really from nature. Humans made them. We bred sheep specifically over thousands of years. And now they're a special animal made just for us to live with us. And that means they need us to take care of them. When it comes to people, we're a lot like sheep. God made us, and God loves us, and because God made us, and because God loves us, we need God. We like to be around God, hanging out with God, doing what God wants, spending time with God, and listening to God help us live healthy, safe, happy lives. Just like the sheep who need the humans to help them keep all that heavy, yucky wool off them, we need God to help us deal with all the heavy, yucky stuff that's out there in the world. Jesus talks about this in the Bible. He compares people to sheep and himself to the person who takes care of the sheep. He's very careful to explain that all the sheep belong to him. He loves every single sheep, even a really dirty sheep or a confused sheep, a sheep that's been gone for a long time, a sheep with lots of bugs on it, a sheep that's kind of mean, a sheep that's shy. Jesus loves all of them, and he wants to help take care of all of them. Any sheep that runs away, Jesus wants to go get so he can continue to love and help that sheep. We are those sheep. We can stay where Jesus loves us and wants to take care of us, wants to help us. We can recognize that we were made by God, and because we were made by God, we belong with God. We love God, and God loves us. Without God, things are a lot harder. Now, that doesn't mean with God everything is easy. Even sheep that live with the shepherd sometimes get bugs on them, they get dirty, they get scared. Sometimes a wolf comes and tries to attack them. Life's not perfect when you're a sheep. And life's not perfect with God either. The difference is, when the sheep live with a shepherd who loves them and looks after them, they always have a safe place to go. They know that someone will love them and take care of them, even when the wolf comes, even when it rains and it's cold, even if there's swarms of nasty bugs. The shepherd can't make those go away right away, but he can say, I'm here for you. I'll take care of you. I love you. So today, I want you to think about if there's anything heavy, like Shrek the sheep had all that heavy wool on him. Is there anything that feels heavy in your life? Is there anything that feels icky or yucky that makes you feel sad or angry? Think about what you would do if you were a sheep. You would go find the shepherd and you would let the shepherd help you. But since you're a person, you can go find God and let God help you. So how do you do that? How do you go find God and ask for help 
like a sheep goes to the shepherd and asks to be taken care of. Well, one of the best ways to do that is by praying. You can pray with your words by just telling God what's going on, how you feel, and how you want God to take care of you. Or you can pray by being quiet, being still, and listening to what God might be sharing with you. A lot of people like to do this while on a walk outside in nature. Another really good way to seek out God and be taken care of is to spend time at church. Sheep like to hang out together in a big group with all their friends, called a flock. When they're together, they're happier and they're safer. When we gather together at church, it makes it a little bit easier for the shepherd, God, to keep track of us, to take care of us, and to show us love. We're also with our friends from church, other people who can help answer our questions, pray with us, and take care of us. Church gives us a chance to sing songs, to learn things about God, and to be like a sheep in a flock that is very, very loved. Today, try to be like a sheep. Remember, there's a shepherd who loves you and wants to take care of you, and you can go to that shepherd anytime for help, for love, for rest, for peace, in any way you want. Spend time today with a God who loves you and wants to take care of you. See if there's anything heavy or yucky that God can help you out with. And always remember, when you're at St. Mark's, you're part of an awesome flock of other sheep who love you very, very much.